Good morning, Graham High School. I'm Lexi. I'm Jack. And here's what's in the news. Juniors and seniors, Eastern Michigan University, Aquinas College, Concordia University, Western Michigan, Hope College, Kendall College of Art and Design, Northwood, and U of M will be visiting Heartland next week. If you're interested, check your school emails. Also, the Parent Advisory Committee is doing their annual parking spot raffle. If you're interested in an absolutely beauty of a parking spot in the front of the student doors, see the Student Council students by the cart in the commons during lunch today. Only $1 per ticket. Homecoming is the week of October 3rd, so just a week and a half away. Check your school email for the Spirit Days, and the winning fourth hour received donuts and cider. The dance will be on Saturday, October 8th, from 7 until 10 p.m. in the gym. Tickets are $15 and will be on sale homecoming week during all lunches. Guest pass applicants are available now in the front office. They are due back no later than 3 p.m. next Friday. Lexi, do you know what day it is? I, I don't know, actually. It's game day! Now to Chloe and Joy for sports. Thanks, guys. Good luck to the boys varsity football team who take on Plymouth tonight at 7. Be sure to show up in your gold. Congrats to the JV and varsity field hockey teams who both beat Brighton. JV won 2-0 and varsity won 4-0 with three goals from Chloe Caldwell. Now over to weather with G and Bird. You didn't let me. Thanks, guys. The weather today is a low of 41 and a high of 64. The rest of the week is looking chilly, being in the low 60s all week with a chance of rain on Sunday. If you're going to the football game, make sure you dress accordingly because it is going to be chilly tonight, but make sure you're wearing gold, more importantly. Uh, continuing the joke, uh, what do a tick and the Eiffel Tower have in common? I don't know. That one stumped me. They're both parasites. <laughs> That's all for the student news. I'm Sam. And I'm Braden. And have a great day, Harlan High School. You got